us from Bravo TV's Vanderpump Rules, Tom Sandoval and the most extras are coming to the Lou. The St. Louis native is returning for a hometown concert with his 10 person band, also known as the Ultimate Party Band. The group has grown to become music's new must see cover band. I chatted with Tom to hear more on what performing back in the 314 means to him. Take a listen. Hey Tom, the Ultimate Party Band hitting the stage. We're so excited. What can we all expect at Ballpark Village? Oh, well, exactly what you just said. I mean, it's going to be it's going to be a party. It's going to be a really good time. I'm really stoked to be coming back to St. Louis, my hometown, um, Ballpark Village. I've had so many great memories there, you know, mostly after seeing winning Cardinal games. Um, and uh, yeah, I mean, we, you know, we're a 10 person cover band. We have a full brass section. We play everything from 70s, 80s, 90s, 2000s, uh, you know, uh, Everything from Cake by the Ocean to Billy Ocean. When you when you listen to you guys, it's not what you would think just a typical cover. You add a lot of unique twists to it. Some of them we we stick, you know, closer to the original, but um, but yeah, we definitely do like to kind of change stuff up a little bit and add our own little like spin on things. And let's dive into a little bit about returning back to St. Louis. How does it feel? It feels great. You know, with this band, uh, especially like I didn't know how it'd be received. Like it's just, it's really blown up, and and it's it's been so amazing. Like the fans uh, are 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 incredible. And being in St. Louis, is there anything you are especially excited to go back to to see? Any stops you're hoping to make? Obviously, I love going back to see my family and my friends. Um, I know you said music. This is kind of the new thing that you've been together for a year, but your newest restaurant. I heard there's some STL ties. We're trying to figure out um, a way to do like toasted raviolis. Um, yeah. Okay. I moved to St. Louis in the summer. I'm actually not originally from here. Where, Where would you, you say? I'm from Indianapolis. Oh, right on. Okay. Yeah. Where would you say are the best tea wraps? Because everyone has an opinion I've noticed. And I have, I've been learning. I think Russo's makes the best uh, toasted raviolis. Russo's. Oh, I'm going to go to Russo's. The last question that I actually had for you would just be kind of reflecting on your career, the success that you've had, where you are now, and thinking about when you were here in St. Louis in high school. What What would you say? What would your younger self say if they saw what you've accomplished, what you've done? I don't know. I don't know if I, uh, my younger self might be a little bit in uh, disbelief. You know, I never thought I would be on a reality show, uh, have like a cosmetic line the opening bars in LA and now being like a awesome cover band. Like <laughs> hopefully a lot of maybe STL kids kind of looking for a dream can look to you. Yeah. I mean, I just think that, you know, if you really want to do something, just, just go for it and uh, give it your all and, and go after it, you know? And if you're, if you're a good person and you, and you, you do good by others, like I, I think good things just will happen to you. All right, so that performance is next Saturday, January 28th. Tickets are still available at stlballparkvillage.com slash events. Man, it's, it's going to be a party.